the black panther the black panther oh Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Beverly from the Uptown Body. I hope you've been having a phenomenal week. We are here to celebrate something special and that is the season of fall. Uh, speaking of new season, your girl also got a promotion at work. Yeah, enough of that. But it's been taking a little bit of a toll on my skin. So I'm sorry if you see a couple bumps here and there, but they have been putting your girl through it, like, but it was partially my fault. Like I tried a new foundation, new makeup wipes. I put witch hazel on my face, knowing good and well my skin doesn't like witch hazel. I'm gonna do a skin routine uh, video later on showing how I got rid of like all most of my dark spots and how I dealt with acne. Um, but today we're focusing on fall makeup. It's not gonna be anything too crazy, I don't think. Not too crazy. But let's get into it. So, as always, I'm going to start with my brows. Starting with the LA Girl Pro Conceal and Fawn to outline my brows. Oh, but before we go any further, please, like and subscribe. <laughs> like this video and subscribe to my channel so that way you can get all these helpful videos and new looks whenever they drop. And by all means, click the little bell so you can get the notifications as well. So. Yeah, so just started by outlining my brows. Yeah, this, this, the way my face is looking, this is why you should drink your water and mind your business because this usually doesn't happen when I'm doing only those things. Just drink your water, write down your goals, <laughs> and mind your business. So I'll know that I have that portion all Secured, security, I grabbed the P. Louise base and popped it all on top, right below it. Don't get crazy. And today's not gonna be super dramatic, so we don't need <laughs> no drama. I'm gonna use my sponge to merge them together. So I've been spending a whole lot of time at the um, Ulta in Pearland, and they just popped this in my bag as like a gift for, I guess like all the Makeup Revolution stuff I got. I said, oh, well, thank you. And I've been using it ever since, and I've really been liking it. So I'm gonna be using this like raspberry shade right here first. And just put that all in my crease. Gonna get rid of some of the excess and just kind of soften out the outside corners. There's this bright orange shade in the Zulu palette. I'm just gonna use that to kind of that one right there. I'm gonna use that a little bit to further blend out the corners. Just a little bit. And that's to soften up the corners a little bit. I love orange in the fall. Orange and olives and like burnt sienna colors. Love it. That's kind of cute. That is kind of cute. I'm gonna grab my slightly smaller Anastasia brush and use the fluffy side and grab this dark brown also in the Zulu palette. If you can't tell, I'm obsessed with this palette. It's very useful. And just put some on the very outside corners and the very inside corners. And then I'm first gonna take this orange shade. Ooh, that's really bright. <laughs> I'm gonna take this, Jesus Christ. Where, where do we go? Where do we go that it's not so bright? I'm gonna take this orange shade here and then this gold shade orange first and then put the, I guess, rose gold on top of it. So right down the middle, like that. Ooh, this is interesting. The more I go over it, the prettier it gets. So 
I'm just gonna stop right here because I'm I'm very easily I can very easily keep going. I'm gonna stop. Here, this is just a Maybelline Maybelline mascara. One of my favorite drugstore brands. Got my dual glue. And the lashes I'm gonna use, of course, are from the Uptown Body and Lucky. And while the lashes dry, I'm just gonna get started on my eyebrows. I'm not gonna fill them in a ton. So for that, I'm gonna be using the e.l.f. Ultra Precise Brow Pencil in Neutral Brown. Just clean that off, okay? Grab this again. And yeah, I'm gonna get my lashes on and then I'll come back and finish. Okay. I can live with this. I actually really like this eye. I will be doing this again. Little raspberry orange fall eyeball. Okay, so to prime, I'm gonna be using my favorite professional. Um, for the fall, I tend to be drier in the fall. I'm still pretty oily. I don't know about you and your people, but me and my camp, we gonna continue to prime around here, just in case. Can't afford to be shining in these streets. Can't afford it, it's expensive. And this time for my foundation, I'm going to Old Faithful. NYX Total Control in Cappuccino. Oh girl, this is like water. This is like water. I don't remember being this watery. Okay. So I won't put it on the back of my hand. I'm gonna put it straight on my face. <laughs> you know what? After having used the Can't Stop Won't Stop Foundation, this seems to have a lot of moisture in it. Like a lot of moisture. Like, like if I didn't prime with this or if I didn't set this, I'd be in a whole bunch of greasy trouble. A whole heap of trouble. That's good enough. So next. Back to my LA Girl Pro Conceal. And conceal under eyes. And this helps me with my laugh lines, which are relentless. They don't care about my endeavors to be cute. They just want to remind me that I need to drink more water. So this is something I saw from Alyssa Ashley. It's not the exact same formula. Uh, she, I watched a video that she did and she talked about um, a powder that she had found at Sephora that she used to kind of set everything. And this is the, it's actually from Maybelline. I went to Sephora. I didn't find it in my color. But I also went to the Sephora in Pearland. So yeah. So this is the Maybelline Fit Me in color 330 for toppy, for normal to oily skin. And then that's what I've been using for like the past week and I really like it. Helps to marry everything together. Girl, I look like a model. I do, but I love the finish that it gives you. It's like a matte, poreless finish. Literally, it's literally a poreless finish. Um, I've been using it specifically anywhere I have an issue with like lines on my forehead and my laugh lines and it's been helping tremendously. But I can go about my day and not 
be harassed by them. Like I said, I love a matte face. If you are not big on um, like that shine free look, uh, they also have another formula for um, for more dry skin. So that's gonna hydrate you a lot better and it doesn't give you so, um, I guess so, such this kind of finish if you're looking for something a little bit more hydrating. All right, after that, gonna bronze. Oh, my usual areas. I'm sorry, contour, my usual areas. Love this brush from Real Techniques. Just hugs right up under my cheekbone. And then it's fluffy so you can still buff it out. Girl, this vegan, this vegan vegetarian thing got my clavicle bones, my cheekbones looking, you know, Vanessa Williams-ish, Tayana Taylor-ish. And we thank God. And then for my highlight, like I said, I'm gonna use this goldish shade here, the rose gold shade, as a highlight too. Because I, I knew it would be useful in more than one way. I just knew it. I'm really cheap okay i'm just gonna say it the nicest way i know how I'm, I'm cheap so i like getting multiple uses out of things multiple multiple i mean like using dark brown eyeshadows as brow fillers or um eyeliner pencils as brow pencils or lip liners you know make it work make it work Stretch that coin. Look at that, that did a good job. Ignore my butt, but it did a good job. And then for my lips, my all time favorite winter fall lip. This is, well, disclaimer. Stila, I'm very biased towards Stila because I know I can put on Stila for breakfast and for dinner. Stila uh, all day, their lipstick, their matte lipstick is still gonna be on at dinner time and for dessert and whatever happens at the dessert. But this is the Stila all day liquid lipstick in shade Rico and this is my, it's a godsend. So I'm gonna put that on. Mm-hmm. Girl, I come alive in the fall time, okay? I come alive. <laughs> I actually need to go re-up because we have a long winter ahead of us, you know? Gotta get ready for that. And it's a comfortable finish. It's not like a, a harsh tugging type of matte. Very comfortable. Very wearable. Very wearable. Very wearable. I enjoy it. It's one of my absolute favorites. A favorite, you know? Yeah. I'm happy with this. This is kind of romantic, y'all. I like it. I really do. So, anywho, if you have any questions about the product, about my lashes, about um, this lip color, I'm going to try my best to tag everything down below. Um, yeah, feel free to leave me a comment, shoot me an email. It's been a joy. So don't forget to drink your water, mind your business, write your goals down, knock them out. Thanks for watching. Mwah.